Global Issues class. Welcome to another week of online learning. Um, hopefully you're kind of starting to get in the groove. Um, I'll admit, I mean, I, I, I kind of am. It actually is becoming somewhat normal. So hopefully, you know, it is for you too, whether that's, you know, for better or worse. Um, all right. So here's kind of just 10 second review, right? Uh, last lesson, you looked at the process to become an immigrant and then a citizen. So you looked at uh, what are the the groups that we tend to accept when they apply for immigration to the United States. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then what's the process to go from being an immigrant to a citizen? Okay. So now today we're going to start to to unpack some of the major arguments that appear in terms of being in favor of allowing immigration, in favor of being against immigration. Um, but today we're going to specifically zoom in on uh, what are the problems that exist in our country because of illegal immigration, or sometimes these people are called undocumented immigrants, right? Um, I'll tend to use the, the term illegal immigration, uh, but again, sometimes the, you'll hear undocumented as, as well, right? It just means they haven't filled out the, the proper paperwork. Um, one misconception that I put in the handout that you'll be reading, but I want to highlight it here just quickly, um, are actually our number one problem with about 55% of illegal immigrants having this happen to them um, is not that people, you know, jump the fence or like sneak into the country, right? That's that's about 45% of our illegal immigrants. But the majority, right, right about 55%, actually they, they come here by law. Maybe they're a student uh, in college. Maybe they get a temporary work visa uh, to work for a company for, for a year or two. Uh, maybe they come on vacation. And then when they're supposed to go back to their home country, they just never leave. Okay, and so that's incredibly difficult to stop. Right? I mean, what are you going to have? A government agent following them around the whole time they're here? Um, not likely. So it's really hard to stop that type of illegal immigration. And that's actually the majority of our um, illegal immigration actually is that form. So, all right, the, the lesson today then encompasses a couple parts. Uh, short handout, it's probably like half a page uh, about the problems that illegal immigration causes. You've got a few questions about that. Um, and then you also have um, something that you have to post on a discussion board. It, it's not a discussion board. But what it is, um, you are going to cr be creating a fictional person or a fictional family that might apply for citizenship. And then we're going to use these um, fictional people that you create in the lesson tomorrow. So all you have to do is put this on the discussion board. And the reason I want that is so that anyone in class could see your fictional person or family um, so that we could then use them tomorrow. Okay, so you're not going to have to comment anybody's. Uh, that's not the point of it. Um, in this lesson is just to, again, answer some questions about illegal immigration and then um, post in the discussion board uh, a family or a person that you create. And I've put all the categories and information that you would have to put about them. Okay, You could just um, copy that template if you want right into the discussion board and then fill in uh, the blanks with the information needed. So, all right. As normal, contact me if you've got questions, right? I'll be uh, around the computer all day.